Hello and welcome to 8th session of ASME B31.3 course. I am Alif. I hope you are doing well. In the previous session, we have covered the concept of design pressure. In this session, I am going to talk about the design temperature and then we will focus on design minimum temperature based on paragraph 301.3 of ASME B31.3. The design temperature of each component in a piping system is the temperature at which under the coincidence of pressure, the greatest thickness or highest component rating is required in accordance with the code requirement. This definition is same as design pressure. It means that the condition that results to the greatest thickness or highest component rating will govern the design temperature discussed in the previous session. However, there is another design temperature that is not related to pressure design of piping component. In other words, this temperature, that named design minimum temperature, is not used for calculation of wall thickness or determining rating of piping components. You know, metals are ductile in room temperature. However, if temperature drops below a certain level, the metal becomes very brittle. So we should ensure that our piping system will save when experiencing low temperature. As discussed, we rely on the SME B31.3 code to establish the engineering requirement for safe design of our project. The code includes references to acceptable material specifications and guidance and limitation on their selection and application. Therefore, it is code's scope to specify the design minimum temperature for each material. Let's look at the definition used by ASME B31.3 for it. Design minimum temperature is the lowest component temperature expected in service. This temperature may establish special design requirements and material qualification requirements. Let's find out how design minimum temperature is specified by the code. Referring to previous sessions of this course, you are familiar with Table A1, basic allowable stress intention for metals of ASME P31.3. You know that this table is used for specifying allowable stress of materials listed in this table per temperature. This table is also used for determining minimum temperature. Referring to Note 6 of this table, the minimum temperature shown is that design minimum temperature for which the material is normally suitable without impact testing other than that required by material specification. However, the use of material at design minimum temperature colder than minus 29 degrees Celsius or minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit is established by rules elsewhere in this code, including paragraph 323.2.2 and other impact test requirements. For carbon steels with a leather designation in the minimum temperature color, see paragraph 323.2.2e and the applicable curve and nodes in figure 323.2.2a. I'm gonna explain note 6 of table A1 of ASME B31.3. First, it means that the minimum temperature in table A1 refers to design minimum temperature. Then, it says that we can use all material at design minimum temperature or warmer than minimum temperature with no additional requirements such as impact test if design minimum temperature is minus 29 degrees Celsius. However, when design minimum temperature is lower than minus 29 degrees Celsius, 
we shall follow requirements specified in paragraph 323.2.2 and table 323.2.2 you can find that two methods used for specifying minimum temperature in table A1. In the first method, the exact minimum temperature is specified. For example, for ASCM A369 grade FPB, minimum temperature is equal to minus 20 degree Fahrenheit or minus 29 degree Celsius. It means that this material doesn't need impact test for temperature at minus 20 degree Fahrenheit and warmer if we want to use it at temperature lower than minus 20 degree Fahrenheit we shall refer to paragraph 323.2.2 and table 323.2.2 another method is specifying a character or designation A, B, C and D that refers to curves in figure 323.2.2a for example the minimum temperature of ASTM A381 grade 35 specified by designation A and for API 5A grade B specified by character B for these cases in addition to temperature the thickness of material is also important for specifying the requirement for impact testing. We may have three conditions. Based on the designation, if design minimum temperature thickness combination of material is on or above the curve and the design minimum temperature is minus 29 degrees Celsius or warmer than there is no need for impact testing. If a design minimum temperature thickness combination is on or above the curve and design minimum temperature is lower than minus 29 degrees Celsius, we shall follow table 323.2.2. If a design minimum temperature thickness combination is below the curve, impact testing is required. Next episode will be a workshop. With an example, I will show you how to use table 323.2.2 and figure 323.2.2a. I wish you find this session beneficial. Thank you for being with us.